Love and Light, My Soul Tribe, all you beautiful cosmic surfers. I am Kane, and if I am able, I am here to assist in any way possible. Every relationship in life is based on an exchange of energy. And there are two main types of people in the world, taps and drains. Those which lift you and fill you up, those which drain you and pull you down. In truth, everything we do in life is based on an exchange of energy. From exchanging your time and energy for money when you go to work, exchanging energy in a conversation between two people, to the act of lovemaking and exchanging energy between yourselves. Any time an exchange of energy is one-sided, any time it's not equal or balanced, that relationship is ultimately doomed. When is dependent on how long the tap is willing to fill the drain. Anytime somebody wrongs you in life, does something against you, to hurt you, make you feel a lack, hard done by, poor me, this is them stealing your energy. And any time you think about this event in the, part, in the future, you are giving them control and power over you. You're allowing them to further steal your energy. This is done almost by them attaching a hose pipe to you, one which drains your energy from you, and will continue to do so as long as you allow it. As long as you allow them power over your emotional happiness, they will continue to drain you. Your happiness is far too important to give to another person. You hold the power, as with everything in life, and you are able to stop them draining you. This is true in anything negative in life. Somebody who wrongs you, the end of a relationship, somebody who always makes you feel a lack or lower than they are. This is because they are stealing your energy. Certain people are able to steal your energy more, affect you more, get to you more, right? This is because your ego attachment to them, your ego relationship to them is stronger. It's almost like the hose connecting you is wider. These are the people which are closest to you in life and able to rub you up the wrong way more easily. It is your choice as with everything in life. And when you have decided you'd have enough of feeling drained, of feeling lack and low from another person's influence on you, something they have done, some way they have wronged you, there is a simple but powerful technique which I would like to share with you in order to take back your power, take back control over your own emotional well-being. This is done by closing your eyes and visualising the two of you and a hose which connects you, a hose which the energy flows down. Picture a golden thread attaching the two of you. One which they use to steal your energy. Take a pair of crystalline diamond scissors and cut that thread. Your ego will not want you to do this. It will not want you to disattach from them. It will say, no, if we disconnect, who will we be? They are part of us. Our relationship with them has defined who we are. This is true, but you are not disconnecting your relationship, only the unhealthy energy exchange between yourselves. And your ego is scared of this, because when you do this, you are taking back your power, taking back control over your happiness. And the ego will struggle to control you, because you will now be in control. Visualise this cord, 
this hose that connects you being cut. When it is cut, remove all the length of cord, clean off the connections at each end so that they are clean and ready to attach a new cord to, to create a new relationship with them, one which you decide, one which you choose the energy flow between you, not one which is unhealthy and been learned and accepted over the years, but one which you control, one which benefits you. This technique doesn't just work with an ended relationship, it works with current ones. Any relationship which is one-sided, unhealthy, and leaves you feeling drained or a lack in any way, this technique can be used for. Your parents are a prime example. When you grow up, your parents are in charge of you, in charge of your happiness, and you grow up trying to please them, trying to get happiness back from them. You take this with you through life as you grow, wanting to please them but always feeling drained, a very one-sided, lacking feeling of energy exchange, a relationship which you wish felt better but never quite does. Use this technique Cut that old unhealthy relationship between you where they told you what to do and you look to them for your happiness as a child and recreate a new relationship based on being an adult. A mutual relationship with mutual energy exchanges between the two of you. This can be used for any relationship. Anybody who feels you, makes you feel lack or drained. Your boss, a sibling, a friend, parents, partner, any relationship which is one-sided, cut the cords, make new cords which you decide, which you control that energy flow. And in doing so, you will be taking back your happiness, taking back control over your own life, and stepping into becoming the creator that you are. Love and light, one and all. And until next time, namaste.